I hate running. So I decided to challenge myself and wake up at 4.30 a.m. every day for a week and go on a run alone in the dark. I'll see you on day one. Good morning. It is five o'clock a.m. I've been up for about a half an hour and basically the goal here is to wake up at 4.30 every morning this week and go on a run. So yeah, as you can see, it's it's, it's dark outside. I'm not really even that tired. I went to bed around 9 last night, feeling pretty good. I'm a bit nervous because it is really dark outside. So I wonder how this is going to go. It's my first time filming a YouTube video. So I figured I wanted to do this and I figured it would, it would be cool to film it and see if it's any help to other people. So let's get it. I can't even see outside. It's quite chilly out here. It's really cold. I can still see the stars out. Nobody's out, obviously. All the houses are dark. I'll let you know when I get back. All right, guys, I finished my run. It's 5.48 right now. I ran about 1.85 miles, which is not as far as I normally do, but I just figured this morning I would scope it out. It was a good run. I'm sweating some uphill, some downhill. Man, it was super dark. There were some spotlights, but there was like two or three on the whole run. I ran down to this ice cream shop. It's about like a mile away. Well, a little less because then I would have ran over two miles. But um, over there, it's more lit because there's some shops. But there's some parts where I'm just running. I have my watch flashlight on so cars can see me and so I can see the road. There was one section. It was kind of through the woods. Couldn't see anything. It's kind of scary to be honest. But yeah, I had a great run. Finished before six, which is crazy. Yeah, one day I'll take this and I'll show you guys what it looks like out there. It's crazy. It's really surreal. It's a great run. I'm dripping sweat, even though it was actually colder than I thought. Not as humid as I thought, which is really nice. So, yeah, I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It's 5 a.m. again. <laughs> I'm really tired today. But here I am. I got up. I have my windows open, or at least one of them, and it's really cold. I assume it's, it's pretty chilly outside. I'm excited to get down there. My goal today is at least two miles, but we'll see. Feeling really tired, but let's get after it. guys I'm, I'm bringing a flashlight today it's really bright all right guys i just got back i did 2.22 miles it's a good run i'm dripping sweat right now i don't think i'm going to wear a sweatshirt again it starts off cold but obviously i warm up a lot and i start sweating a lot that's okay um bringing a flashlight today was good actually there's some really dark parts and it's actually terrifying not even gonna lie but I saw some cows today, actually. So I run to this. It's it's like a it's an ice cream shop, but they sell like dairy products, and they have a farm. So across the street they have they have a barn and a whole bunch of cows. I looked over and they were all laying down, looking at me. It was really cool. But yeah, I met my goal today, two miles, exceeded it by point twenty two. So I'm really happy about that. I'm excited to take a shower and stop sweating so much. So yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna film a little bit more of my run because I gotta get some footage of me running, you know? But yeah, see you tomorrow. All right, it's time to run. It is actually not as cold as it was yesterday. So actually it's great. It's a bit humid, it's wet, good for filming, good for running. I just finished with my run, literally. Just got home. 2.26 miles. Yeah, all right. So you can tell I'm so sweaty. It's a good run, it's a good run. There's this guy behind me running. Honestly, kind of scary, but yeah, feeling good, sweaty. Glad it wasn't very cold today. It was not cold at all. It was humid. Um, I was out there for about 35 minutes. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. And I also saw a biker, which is sick. So I saw two people today, which is dope. So, cool. How was day three? All right, see ya. All right, guys, it's day four. Today's Thursday. Right now, it's 5 a.m. I am extremely tired today. I'm not feeling good. I have a headache. I feel dead. I went to bed way later than I wanted to last night. Probably every second I've considered going back to sleep, but I'm staying awake. I really do not want to do this today. Now I have to go run in the dark. Man, it sucks, but I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I'll see you downstairs. It's warm today, kinda humid. 
can tell I'm gonna be sweating a lot. I can still see the moon, that bright thing right there. I honestly still can't believe I did not go back to sleep. It was a struggle, but I'm here now. Let's get this. All right, guys, I'm back. I didn't get many shots. Sorry about that. I really just would rather run as much as I hate it. Sweating a lot. It's actually a good run. I feel pretty good now. I did 1.87, which is not a lot. Oh, there's a bug in my hair. That's weird. Okay. Um, <laughs> like I was saying, 1.87, not a lot. Honestly, I'm just so happy that I got myself to get out of bed, get out of my room, and, and go run. That was the hardest morning I've ever had. It was, no, it was bad. I did what I had to do, you know? Running on like six hours of sleep last night and the night before, which is low for me. But I'm honestly surprised I, I am functioning. The reason why I was able to stay up was thinking about my future self and how, if I did run, how proud and amazing I would feel. It's starting to get lighter out. It's so nice out here though. Yeah, great run. This was day four. See you later. Good morning. It's Friday, day five. Um, I'm pretty tired today. I got more sleep last night though than I have been getting the last two nights, so I'm really happy about that. Feeling a little bit more energetic, but tired and honestly i'm ready to be done with this this has really sucked but i woke up and i heard it raining outside so i guess we'll go downstairs and see how it is but i'm not looking forward to that gotta do what you gotta do let's get after it in the rain i actually I think it's just that thing over there probably from when it was raining i don't feel anything that's actually great. I was not excited to get soaked today. I'm actually gonna put my sweatshirt inside. So I was planning on it to be raining, but I'm very glad it's not. Ready to run. I'm really hungry. I don't care. I'm gonna eat later. So hopefully this is a good run. Let's do it. It's actually nice out today. I don't know if you can see, but the roads are soaked. Oh, now it's raining. You can see that. All right, let's keep running. Let's get it. Oh, I just went through a massive puddle. Hey. I did, and I'm almost to my house, dude. I'm starving. Anyways, I'm gonna finish my run. I'll catch you later. All right, guys, finish me my run. Honestly, probably the best run I've had this week. Yep, I broke two miles today. Running in the rain, it was sick. It wasn't raining the whole time. There was a part where it was like pouring, but it was so nice, as you can hear. This is not all sweat. Most of it's rain. Yeah, this morning I'm energetic. I feel good. Dude, the rain, it, it was so refreshing. There's a little breeze. I love it. It sucks, man. But once I just get going, I love it. It was hard, and honestly, like, I was terrified going into this. I've been wanting to do this, like, run in the dark for a while now, and, like, it's it's a mental game. I saw that yesterday. Yesterday was the hardest morning I've ever had. Once you wake up, it's like, man, I can go back to sleep. I want to go back to sleep right now. But I'm hungry, actually. I'm going to go take a shower and eat, so I'll see you. All right, good morning. It's day six. It's a Saturday. I've never gotten up this early on a Saturday. 5.09 a.m. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good today. A little bit tired. I did get to go to bed at a good time last night. So, yeah, I'm excited about it. I'm not sure if it's cold, but we're gonna have to see, so, yeah. All right, it is cold out. <laughs> yeah, that's the moon. I think it's clear out. I see some stars, yeah. I think I heard a wolf. Dang. Hopefully I won't get eaten by wolves, but let's go, man. Let's go. It's almost six right now. I've been running for about 23 minutes. The sun coming up. It's actually really nice. All right, I'm gonna keep moving. All right guys, I finished with my run. I just hit two miles. Look, two miles. It's 6.02. That was a sick run, man. Yeah, I'm sweating. Sweating a lot. 
I did not get eaten by wolves, obviously. I didn't hear them again since I started, or since that time I heard them. But great weather. I mean, it was chilly, but now, now I'm sweating a ton, so. Man, it's starting to get light out. I still see the moon. I still see some stars. It's fantastic. Fantastic. I heard some strange noises, but whatever, man. Honestly, some of those parts are terrifying. But one thing I repeat over and over in my head is 2 Timothy 1, 7. For God did not give us a spirit of fear and timidity, but of power, love, and self-discipline. I love that verse, man. It really shows that, like, we're not meant to live in fear. We can't let it stop us from doing things that we need to do or want to do. But, yeah, anyways. Man, it's getting rapidly brighter out here. I don't know if you could see better, but... Anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, guys, it's day seven. It's the final day. Thank God this has sucked. I'm so ready to be done with this. It's been a crazy week, but it's been really good. So, yeah, I'm glad I did it. I'm really tired today, but that's okay. So, hopefully I have a good run. Yeah, I'll see you downstairs. It is cold out again. It's quiet. Stars are out. I don't see the moon, but whatever. It's the last day. Let's just get it over with. It's pretty cold out. I'm already starting to sweat though. I'm sick, you can see my breath. All right, guys, I just finished my last run of this challenge. And whew, man, it was good. It was really windy, actually. Uh, I'm sweating a lot now. Actually, I'm gonna take off my sweatshirt. Hold up. I went 2.04 miles, 6.01 now, about a half an hour run. One person I was, I was running and basically there's like a stop sign that was kind of parallel to me. So they stopped perpendicular to me. And I heard them coming, so I didn't want to keep running because if they didn't see me, maybe if they ran the stop sign or something, it would hit me. So I kind of was walking and <laughs> they stopped right in front of me, like not right in front of me, a few feet away. And they definitely saw me because I had my flashlight on and I think they're really scared. So that was funny. Anyways, yeah, man, it was a good run. Good week, man. It's crazy. Honestly, I thought about quitting like every day. For some reason, I didn't. And I'm really, really glad I didn't. It was, it was an amazing experience. Yeah, it was totally worth it. Although it was scary <laughs> and it did suck, but I honestly didn't know I was even capable of waking up at 4.30. But man, what a week, what a week. I hope this is of some value to someone. That was really my whole goal of filming it, you know? I was gonna do it by myself, but yeah, I, I thought it would be cool to share my experience, but man, I'm so glad this is over. I hate running. Well. I'm going to do another challenge next week, so stay tuned. So, yeah, see you next time.